Axle oils consist of a precise blend of chemical components, each carefully selected to create the desired quality and performance in the final oil. The base oil is the main component. It's from 36 to 96% of the gear oil. There may be no viscosity modifier or it can be as high as 50%. A pour point depressant, or PPD, may be added up to 2% of the total oil volume. And finally, the axle oil additives might be from 4 to 12%. In this video, we'll look more closely at viscosity modifiers and pour point depressants. The mineral base oils commonly used in axle oils can't meet the axle's low and high temperature operational viscosity requirements by themselves. Viscosity modifiers replace the heavy mineral oil component, which generally is not able to flow at cold temperatures. That's why most axle oils, especially multi-grade and wide-span multi-grade oils, contain a viscosity modifier or a PPD or both. The other reason is the increasing use of Group 2, Group 3, and synthetic base stocks. Their viscosity is relatively low compared to the viscosity needed in the final oil. Viscosity modifiers raise the viscosity to the required level while allowing the oil to flow at cold temperatures. You can see how a monograde oil's viscosity changes as the temperature changes. At low temperatures, the viscosity is higher. And as the temperature increases, the viscosity drops dramatically. This rate of change is called the viscosity index. A multi-grade oil does a better job of maintaining viscosity across the temperature range, but there's still a viscosity difference from the low to high temperatures. With the addition of viscosity modifiers used to make wide-span multi-grade oils, we further change the level of the viscosity index slope. These oils have a smaller viscosity change from low to high temperature, ensuring easy startup on cold winter days and durability at operating temperatures. This is a very desirable trait because it ensures consistent lubricant performance at all temperatures. Another benefit of viscosity modifiers is their ability to help oil maintain its viscosity or stay in grade. The action of metal surfaces sliding against the oil can try and shear the viscosity modifier molecules, reducing their size and reducing the oil viscosity. Viscosity modifiers with high shear stability reduce this effect and help the oil maintain its viscosity. The shear stability is indicated by the viscosity modifier's shear stability index, or SSI. The lower the SSI, the more shear stable the oil is. Viscosity modifiers used for today's wide-span multi-grade axle oils typically have an SSI of about 30. But in the future, as oil drain intervals increase, the SSI will continue to move towards a value of 20 and lower, providing even greater shear stability and longer oil service life. Now let's look at pour point depressants, or PPDs. These additives improve the low temperature viscosity or flow properties of mineral oils. Base oils like mineral oils have a certain level of wax. The PPD functions on a chemical level by changing the crystal structure of the wax so that small, free moving particles of wax are formed. Without the PPD, larger particles would form, quickly thickening the oil and raising the viscosity. Base oils are derived from a variety of crude sources and each has unique properties. To get the desired performance from the final blend, it's critical to properly match the PPD to the base oil. In formulating axle oils, the use of the correct viscosity modifiers and pour point depressants ensures that each oil will meet its viscosity requirements, stay in grade, and provide the right performance for the application.